one. What's up everybody? I'm SM Sith Lord and I'm back to do the Oculus Rift test. This is the DK1 um, after fighting with the NVIDIA driver installer and Windows fighting over who which one gets to install the driver. Um, I finally got my NVIDIA driver updated. Updated my Oculus runtime SDK to 0 0.8 and um, got my DK1 plugged in and everything was good to go. Steam VR worked great. Uh, now I've loaded up Anarchy Arcade um, in VR mode. Now the only thing is, it's not displaying on the right screen. It's displaying down there, not in here. So, to uh, check it out in VR real quick, I'm just going to strap the DK1 to my head like a Google Go Cam. <laughs> and I'm going to go check all this stuff out, so let's go. It's just going to take a second. I'm going to go back into that same spooky Vietnam Halloween house. And see the head tracking's working. Everything's looking good. It's just displaying it on the wrong screen. I can look all around. Very good. All this good stuff. Now you can imagine how um, in VR this is going to be very, very metaverse because all the stuff you see in here are shortcuts to either files on my computer or files on the internet. So, or, you know, like YouTube videos are kind of like files on the internet. So everything is a shortcut. It's not just decoration. So, for example, let's just watch the very beginning of this one because this is a really cool beginning. I'm going to turn it down a little bit. I mean, bearing on the everlasting struggle for world supremacy between and you'll see that it's playing on all these different screens and this is just one screen that I clicked on on this arcade so I mean it just in this one house you saw me walking around the neighborhood so everything that you see here is a shortcut to a game or a uh, video or web video or web game or anything anything that you have on your desktop this is literally a, a 3d desktop and when you launch things uh, it lets your operating system uh, have control about how to display it so right now it's not going to display windows programs native windows programs very well in your headset but in the future that's definitely going to change as headsets get more widespread and their support is uh, better support is added to windows itself so each one of these houses are going to be uh, the node we're going to we're calling a metaverse nodes of an individual and when you walk inside you're going to see his curated selection of what he thinks is the best stuff what do I mean by stuff I mean everything programs pictures movies uh, music uh, wiki pages websites philosophies all that all right that's it for now gonna keep this one short too I love this place. Look what happens when you click on this one over here, for example. Everybody gets to watch this amazing, uh, let me interact with the screen here, oceany water beach video. And it goes with the whole theme of the room. I love it. All right, that's it. See you next time. Peace out.